Right, so the auction's live on the Celica GT4. We've got 13 minutes to go, so let's give Harrison a call, um, see where the bidding is, see where we are, see where we want to be, and talk about this Celica. So. Hello. Hey, Harrison. So, car number two, Celica GT4. You know this is one of my favourite cars. Yeah, this one looks like a, uh, a good one. Uh, yeah. Having a look through. Um, yeah, it does look you... really good. I say the only things I can see are the stripes down the side aren't original, but it looks like they've just been added on, which isn't a massive problem. Okay. I like the number plates being original and the rear badge being original. Um, he said on there the front's been sprayed, which is quite common for them. But it's very rare, this car. I don't think there's hardly any in this gray, um, if any at all, because there's 129 cars left, UK cars. Right. And that includes the other GT4, which are like non-Carlos science cars. Okay. So I reckon it's gonna be yeah, so I have hardly seen any since I've really wanted one because obviously I had one when I was 19 from my dad and I used to drive his one but it wasn't a Carlos Sainz edition and when I've looked into the Carlos Sainz there's actually some really nice rally upgrades on the Carlos Sainz um, okay. compared to the normal one so yeah so where are we oh someone's just gone higher yeah literally as you uh, as you were talking someone's picked us by 500 pounds. Um, well, I think the reserve on this is probably about 17. Um, the problem I have is I know there's, I saw a 30,000 mile car, very, very clean, one owner like this. Okay. Um, and that went for about 26, but it was in red and I don't really want red, I really want this grey. Um, okay. So we're after, so should we, do you want to just hold a little bit with ours? Yeah, I think well, we've got, we got 10 minutes, or just over 10 minutes to go. So um, I think we we hold out for now, see if if anyone else comes in. Um, cause there's a few people that have bid on it so far. So, um, yeah, I think we give it another five and see where we're at and then um, go from there. I see they've put up the underneath pictures now and it's very, very clean, really clean. So the only thing I can see, the engine, a little bit of rust and stuff on there, but they do tend to suffer from that. I don't think they're going to... Yeah, have. so it's, um, it's to be expected, isn't it? I think with, um, sort of the age of the car... The seat, seats are so it's good. 31 years old now, so... Yeah, and I saw one at Heaver that I tried to buy at the car show and... Okay. It was really, really poor condition compared to this. This is like almost as good as it gets, really. Um, so what we got now? Eight minutes. So do you want to go 14? I think we should. Think yeah, we should. go on then, let's do that. Let's go. There was actually 5,000 of these made worldwide. Okay. Um, and I think there's about 440 come to the UK. I think you'll quite like this to drive, actually, if we get it. There you go. All right, we're back to winning again. You've probably never seen many of these, have you, on the road? If any. I can't say I've ever seen one. Yeah. Again, pop-up lights. I love those pop-up lights. They always win. <laughs> <laughs> I like the limited edition badges as well in this. Normally, they're not in good condition, but the badge looks really clean. Um, I see it's got a Nokia car kit in there. But I think it's, it's one owner, but the guy bought it and then hasn't registered it in his name. Okay. That's what I was looking at. Um, so 
So originally supplied as a dealer demonstrator, so that's good. Uh, the V5 shows just one private registered keeper following this. So maybe the dealer registered it, then it went to one. It was acquired from this long-term owner by the seller who has not registered the car in their name. Okay. okay. So yeah, very low. I love these one owner cars, like that Golf GTI we bought. Actually, we need to do a video on that, don't we? Um, yeah, you can see the, just looking back at the uh, plate history, you can see that um, it's been been owned by the same person. Um, had a very short number plate on it, to be fair. Um, but no, all, all looks good. It's nice, it's the only thing non-original is the exhaust. Okay. And I love it that it's got the original um, booklets with the car, with the Carlos Sainz. There's a lot of them, you know, you don't get any books and stuff most of the time. No, I think obviously a lot of them have passed you several pairs of hands and mm. stuff that's lost or um, damaged or sold, so... Yeah, it's, it's a, you can always tell a low owner car when it's got all the, uh, the books and history with it. I reckon I've been chasing GT4s for about eight years. I drove past a guy down near Brighton and there was one on his drive and I almost went in there to say, would you sell it? And that was a normal GT4 because I just they're so difficult to find, really hard. And because this car's got like an emotional attachment for me, because obviously, you know, to drive a car like this, 18, 19, I have to have a GT4 back. Um, and also, it was really good to drive. I don't know what it's going to feel like now. I was just looking at it's got 15-inch rims. So that would be interesting. Probably don't even do a proper Michelin in that, that size. Um, but maybe we'll put some rally rims on it. But it'd go well against the Lancia. Because at the time, this was winning all the world championships um, after... Lance here. Yeah. So what we got now? Six minutes. Six minutes. Oh. We're, we're currently winning, um, but uh, I think we're it's yet yet to hit the reserve. So let's see how we get on. So what should I do? Give you a call in three minutes' time. Yeah, give us a yeah. minute, and we'll so um, see where we are. Okay. Yeah. Cheers, Harrison. Cheers. Right, okay. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. This is where it gets really. I don't know, not edgy, but I really want a Celica GT4, like a lot. And I don't really want to let this one go because I really like the grey. I just, for some reason, red just doesn't do it for me. I saw a really good one in red, low miles, and it just doesn't do it for me. The one we had back in the day was a white one, and I thought that looked fantastic. Um, and I always remember with the pop-up lights, actually the light on the road is fantastic, especially at night. Um, but obviously that's going back a long time, so probably you won't have like the LED lights we have now. Um, I do like the bonnet scoop on the Carlos Science Edition, and I like that this has got so many original parts. Um, as the clock's ticking down now, so going down to four minutes. I'm just going to see who's bid on this actually. Let's have a look. So it looks like it's all private bidders. Yeah, I really, really want this car. Come on. Last service, June 23. Uh, repaired the ECU, replaced the timing belt, drive belts, ABS sensor. Someone's gone higher. Hmm. Annoying. Right, Mr. Harrison. The other thing is, what are we going to say is our limit as well? It's tricky because it's not... A huge amount of money in the, the scheme of things and I probably wouldn't sell it for a long time I'd, I'd just keep this car and just drive it and use it put it in the storage take it out um, so right we need to we'll just wait a little bit longer then we'll call Harrison actually I might message him and just say go 15 15 15k I just have a feeling the reserve on this is about 17, but I might be wrong, but we will see. So we're getting down to three minutes, 25. 
hopefully Harrison will put our bid in and then we will give him a call. So the other thing I like on this car is the steering wheel. It's got a really nice steering wheel. And these days they're just, I don't know, not like the old days. Better just phone him just to make sure that message went through. Because we are under three minutes. Hello. So should we go 15? Because someone's gone in front of us now. Alpine Mad. Oh, I bet he likes his classic cars. It's the best stereo ever. Well, that's his, that's his first bid. So is I don't it? know if okay. anybody else is still in the, uh, in the running, but... We'll do it when he gets down to a minute. Oh, you're going to look... You're going to run me right down, aren't you? I'm going to run it right down. <laughs> okay. Ooh. So, under two minutes. It's only in Essex, this car. Well. Actually, you could get Dean to pick it up. And if it's near him, on Canvey Island. Oh, it's gone to no reserve now as well. No reserve? Ooh. No reserve. That means it's tonight. Tonight, we get a car. Well, one out of two isn't bad. Yeah. There might have been three, but I'll talk to you about that. It might have been two out of three. We'll keep that for another video. Um, when are you going to do it, Harrison? You're running me down now. Yeah, let's jump in. Okay. You like doing this to me, don't you? You got it down to like four seconds, right? Well, got to make let somebody else think they've won. I know. Come on. 15. Right, so now it's gone to an extra two minutes, hasn't it? Because we're yeah, in, yes. so, yeah. so everyone has an extra two minutes to bid now. And this is no reserve. If we, so if we get it at 15, I'm really happy. Imagine this and the Lancey, you know, the Evo one. Um, yeah, look good together. Cool. Really good. And you think like an Evo 1 Lancia now, that one I bought. I bought that at Hever, didn't I? What was it? That's gone from sort of 40k to 80k. I haven't even driven it yet. So that's why the this is, you know, even more limited than the Lancia. But I just think it's just under the radar um, as a car. Ah, oh, someone's gone higher, haven't they? Rascals. But only £250. Should we go 15.5 then? Jump straight back in. Uh, run him down. Run, run him down, down. yeah. Okay. Do one of your things now. Run him down. <laughs> you remember that guy kept doing that to us and then sending us laughing emojis? Yes. That really wound me up, that did. And he lost in the end. Although we had to pay 10 million for the car. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Come on, baby. So we're going to go 15,500. Yeah, I think rather than going up in, um, he started small chunks. He, he's there. gone to 250 chunks, hasn't he? So. Yeah, we'll, we'll follow his lead. See how, how long he wants to play the game. It's 50 seconds. Nineteen ninety two, so it's thirty Jesus. Thirty one years old. I'm getting too old. Thirty one years old, jeez. That is crazy. Right, twenty eight, twenty seven. I wonder if this has got an Alpine stereo and that's why he's buying it. <laughs> Maybe. No, it's the original, isn't it? It's still got the original. 
Got to play some CDs. You did it? It was down for about five seconds. So. So you got more? No, no, we're 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 winning now, fifteen five. Okay. So it is a Toyota stereo, actually. It's not an Alpine in there. It says Toyota on it. Okay. Come on. Actually, I'm going to text Dino and say, can you pick up a car in Essex while we're on hold on? Dino. Can you collect a car in Essex? For me. He'll probably come back and say, as long as it's a Lamborghini. How, how long? How long? Ah, oh. what's happened? Someone gone higher. He's gone higher again. Um, are we going to run him down or are we just going to take him out? We, we, we chuck one in now. We'll go 16. Yeah, and then he knows that we're not messing around. What's the fees on this for something so low? Uh, so currently, including the AT, it's £1,150. Okay, that's pretty good value, isn't it? I had eighteen. I had eighteen as our limit. Yes. So we're is. still we are still slightly under that. Yeah, yeah. So we're we're sort of seventeen, seventeen one currently with the uh, with the fees. So come on, give up now, Mister Alpine. Give up. Let me have the car. Otherwise, this car is just going to elude me for ages. That's why I love buying these cars, though, and finding them. Because it's not like you can... I mean, you can just go and get any Lamborghini any time, any Ferrari any time. But to try and find one of these just takes it just takes time. You have to wait, be patient, find the right one. Especially one owner one. It's bloody rare. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Come on. One minute. Come on. Come on. I bet he's going to go 16 to 50. He's got he's got seventeen and a half in his mind for me. He's gonna run us out and he's forty five. Yeah, he's, he's gonna play our game now. I don't know why I feel so nervous about it. Come on. Oh Dino's just come back. He said yeah, he can pick it up. Get this car, go on. 20 seconds. I think it's ours, Harrison. I think it's ours. We said we should the skyline. Here we go. 10. Ten. Five, four, three. It's ours. It's ours. Come on. Check in, check in, check in. What's it checking? Sold. Oh. Lovely jubbly. There we go. Brilliant. Well done. Pleased with that, Harrison. Says you're too late. Oh, I'm not too late. I'm me. I'm the one who bought it. Um, brilliant. Love that. Well done go. for that. Well done for staying late and doing that. Really enjoyed that. No worries. We, and, got, uh, we got one done. We one did, done. Uh, so yeah, what? what's... Um, just trying to think now. What do we do now? Just go and... We need to, well, we need to pay and then we can just go and collect it, I suppose. Yes. Cool. Yeah. Oh, they'll get in touch with you anyway, won't they? Yeah, so I've, I've got the, uh, the owner's details here. Um, so, yeah, we'll, um, we'll give them a call tomorrow and um, get it all settled up and go and collect it. Brilliant. Okay, Harrison, thanks for that. No and uh, speak to you no, tomorrow. Okay, Cheers. Soon. Thank you. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Okay, bye. bye. Yes, I'm pleased with that. I've been trying to get a GT4 forever. And now I've got a Carlos Science one, which is even better. So, yeah, really happy. 
Um, Dino just texted back. He said he can bring it back. I bet he'd love to drive this car. So yeah, I'm going to get on with insuring the car, going through all the bits tomorrow. And then, yeah, I should have it probably end of this week. So hope you're really enjoying these Chasing Modern Classics videos. And we've actually got our first one that we've bought. So I'm really pleased. And I'll see you again soon.